All right, folks, we're looking at a 2004 Polar 2300 walk-around, but it has twin Yamaha 115s. We're going to start and show you the outside of the boat, and we're going to hop inside, show you the inside, show you all the features, give you a little bit of description on everything. See here, it's a baby blue-sided hull, very shiny. There's no scratches, chips, nicks, dock damage, anything like that. Only thing that you can see on the boat, there's this blue stripe and this silver stripe. It's peeling a little bit in the sides. Nothing major, you'll see it in the pictures. Hull's very clean. It's on an aluminum tandem axle magic tilt trailer. It's in good shape. Keep going around the side. You'll see the other side is in the same condition. Pointing is, as I pointed out before, it's a mix in the sticker, nothing major. It shines perfectly. I mean, you can see you can see the reflection in it. It's really nice. It's got a good hard shine to it. If we go on the boat, we'll show you some of the features. You have twin Yamaha 115 four-stroke outboards. They have 260 some odd hours on each outboard. You've got trim tabs. You've got an easy boarding ladder. You see over here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut for a second. We're gonna hop on the boat. We'll be back in a second and show you all the features inside. All right, folks. We're back. We're gonna show you the inside cockpit and the cabin of the boat. Over all the features. Start here. You got a bunch of rod holders in the gunnel. Cup holders. Rod storage on either side for three rods. Tow kicks. Good size live wells on either side. Er, fish boxes on either side. Sorry, I don't know why I said live well. It's been a long day, okay? Back here, just cushion slides out. Got a very large live well in here. It's got an LED light in there. So you can light it at night. So you can see your bait, your live bait fishing. Of course, that pole goes in the hole to work, but... Now, we've gone through the boat. We've ran it on the lake. All the bilges work, pumps work. It's got all brand new batteries with a one-year warranty. We've got a bait station <coughs> over here. Fresh water wash down. Water fills over here. Oops. Sink. Cutting board on top. We've got a knife drawer, and you have three other drawers right there. We've got a seat right here and a drawer, a little storage compartment. You can see back here, you've got an easy dive door access if you need to get to the transom. You've got your Yamaha 115s. You have, a fiber, you have a fiberglass hardtop. Pull your rocket launchers for your rods. Uh, three spreader lights. You've got your Todd fishing seats. All the all the upholstery is in great shape. No rips, tears, cuts. It's all nice and soft and smooth. Faria gauges. Shifters. Stainless wheel. Easy turning knob. Your Lenco trim tab controller. Battery voltage gauge, your windlass at the front of the boat. You got a windlass, easy anchoring. With all your switches for everything. You got a compass, 12 volt plug, and here this flips up. You can have uh, electronics right here and here. So you can hide them away. You can block it if you want. You have another electronics box up here for your VHF radio. You have an, you have a uh, fluorescent spreader light up here on the top of the tower on the inside. Spotlight controller. Got a center battery over here. Under this seat, you got a flip up, flip down, foot rest. Really nice laid out boat. 
for a 23 foot boat is a good size. We're gonna we're gonna open up the cabin and we're gonna slide in the cabin. It's on actuators as you can see, which are stainless and nice shape. This door snaps right here, you just snap that. Stay in place. You want to keep it open while you're out on the water in case the kids are in the cabin. Alright folks, I just was showing Tiny how I keep my hot girlfriend happy. Okay? She's definitely out of my loop. No, seriously, we're gonna go back to reality. Here's the cabin of the boat. Nice sleeping area for two people. Drawer here, some stuff. A single burner stove. We'll flip this up. We'll show you. You could have a head there. Currently, does not. It'd be one of those removable ones. They're about $150. Toilet paper storage. We've got storage under these seats right here. This center cushion pops up. You can use that as a table. The legs up there. We've got cup holders all the way around on either side. Clarion stereo, as I said. Interior cockpit lights. Dan's gonna hand me back, hand me over the camera. I'm gonna show you the kitchenette over here and the hour meters. I'm gonna slide out of your way, actually. I'm not gonna slide, I'm just gonna lay here. It's Thursday, it's about 6.45 at night, and I'm kinda tired. So, just buy the boat so I can go home, okay? No, I'm just kidding. All right, there's the kitchenette. You got a refrigerator, sink, storage. You got an area where you could put a microwave if you wanted one. It hasn't had one, but you could put one in. Be no big deal, 12 volt. You got your fuse panel over here. You can see the hour meters. Uh, one engine has 100 and, uh, 284 hours, and the other one has 288 hours. Clarion stereo, as I was saying before. Give you a little sweeping view. Hand the camera back to Dan. All in all, folks, this is a great all-around fishing boat. 23 feet long with the twin 115 Yamaha outboards. It's four-stroke. You'll never have a problem. We've gone through the boat, our mechanic staff has checked everything out, all the pumps, the bilges, new batteries, we've changed the gear lube, engine oil, new spark plugs, we've done it all fully serviced, we've ran it on the lake, you've probably already seen the video, boat runs great, good luck bidding, and if you have any questions, give us a call, 704-799-0541, ask for Seth or RG, we'll help you with whatever you need, good luck.